Yeah, let me let me speak to who's running that joint over there. Hold on, please. The what? The what? Yeah, who's it? Never mind who the fuck I am. You're gonna have some problems, you fucking boob. I went in there and I ordered a fucking muffler for my car, right? And now that you gave me a bad muffler, I got a freaking ticket for my fucking engine being too loud. Yeah. Now you answer me this. You gonna pay for the fucking ticket? Uh, I don't know. You'll have, you'll have to, uh... Well, let me ask you. What do you know? Yeah, you, you gave me a bad muffler. Now, I'm not no fucking mechanic or nothing, but I know my shit. My son looked at it, and he says the thing was all busted. And when I spit in the cop's face, that didn't feel too fucking good either. I want to know who sold this to me. It was a kid with blonde hair. There's nobody here with blonde hair. My aunt says nobody there with blonde hair. Get him on, get somebody who was working the cash register on the phone. When, when was this, sir? This was two days ago. Two days ago, with blonde hair. Right. I think, I think you're mistaken. I'm not mistaken. What color hair do you have? What color hair do I have? I have dark brown hair. Maybe he dyed it. I don't know. Well, we don't have anybody here with blonde hair. Well, anyway, I know I bought it from your company, all right? Okay, you sure you have the right store? I'm positive. All right? Okay. Now, my wife bought it. She says, hold on a minute. Lorraine, you don't know what the fuck you're talking about. What color hair did the guy have? What? She don't know what color hair he had. All I know is that I, pay, I dropped her off at the place. I went to the market to get some food. I came back and I picked her up. Okay. Can you hold on a second? Yeah. How is it so far, Dave? Good. Yeah? Monday or Tuesday? Well, I, don't, I don't know. There's, there's always a problem with you guys. Two days ago. So that's Tuesday? Yeah. You know, I'm out of work here. I don't need this. Well, if you, can give me, if you can give me your name and type of car, I'll look it up and I'll see what I can find out. All right. It was a 73 Chevy. A 73 Chevy? Right. Okay. And your name? Bob Brady. B-R-A-D-Y. Okay. Hang on a second. Again? Well, I'm checking it. Shit. You're the boss. Can't you have somebody else check that shit? I'm out of work here. I gotta go look for a job. Are you there? Yeah. What do you got to say for yourself? I've got nothing to say for myself. Yeah, well, I grew up, anybody talked to me like that, they would have gave me a black eye. You're sitting there taking it like a pussy. What can I tell you? Yeah, I don't know what you could tell me, but I'll tell you. I ought to go down there and wrap the shit out of you for this shit. I need this like I need a fucking hole in my head, all right? Like a hole in my fucking head. Get myself worked up for some little shit like this. It's always a problem. Always a fucking problem wherever you go. Now, what's the number of that fucking car? Nope, have no record of it, sir. My aunt, you have no record of it. You're just doing it because I'm screaming the fuck at you. Well, that's your prerogative. I have no record of it. If you want to bring the car in, along with the uh, paperwork... You know, you're a ham. That's what I'm going to do, all right? But this is on a... You're a fucking ham, you know that? You really are. You, you take that fucking cake and you swallow it like a fucking pussy. You jerk. You know that? And I want to talk to the guy that owns the place. You're talking to him. You're a rat. That's fine. The whole place is full of rats. 